Hi, this is Katina, and in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to play the theme from The Office. It's a little bit of an intermediate video because we're going to go over to a B natural just once, but otherwise, it's a beginner video. Here we go. We're going to start on a C sharp right here. So you have your thumb down in the back, one, two, three, and then this pinky puts down C sharp. Then you're going to move to an A natural right here by lifting up your pinky and dropping your two fingers in your right hand. And then you're going to go back to C sharp. So this is really good practice for C sharp. And then stay there because you're going to do C sharp A again, back to C sharp, but this time you play a G sharp. So just like the A, you're dropping your third finger and the pinky in the top key right there is G sharp, back to the C sharp. So we're going to play that nice and slowly. So, staying on the C sharp, then back to that G sharp again, back to the C sharp again, A, C sharp is your landing. Then C sharp, A, D, 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 C sharp, B natural right there, C sharp, a, C sharp. So let's play that one. And just like the beginning again, so you have C sharp, A, C sharp, G sharp, C sharp, C sharp, G sharp, C sharp, A, C sharp, so let's play that much. Now, C sharp, A. Notice a pattern here? D, 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 C sharp, B, C sharp, A. Once again, still like the beginning. Here's where it changes because you're going to go up an octave to this throat tone A. When you play that throat tone A, all fingers are up. There's an exception to that. Comment below if you know what I'm talking about when I say resonance fingerings. So you want to play A with the side of your finger right here for A, okay? And then G sharp is right there. But since you're keeping your fingers curved and close, it's sometimes hard to see that you're playing G sharp. And then you're going to go back to that A, remember, curved and close to make it easier, back to the G sharp, and you're going to go to an E natural right there. Lift up your thumb in the back for an F sharp as you're landing. So let's play that whole thing together. Now back to that D natural section where you have D, 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 C sharp, B, C sharp, A, back up to that octave A again, then G sharp on that side, up to the A, and now you're going to go over the break to a B natural here. In order to play the B natural, you have your thumb down and also your register key. You're barely going to touch it, and then you have one, two, three, one, two, three, this pinky down for B. It's okay to rest this pinky here for C, but if your B doesn't work without this, go ahead and have your clarinet looked at by a technician and make sure it's working okay. So you have B, and then you're going to return to that G sharp, and you're going to land on the F sharp right there. I'm going to play that whole section for you nice and slow. <laughs> Turn to the D, 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 C sharp, B, C sharp, A for your landing. And 
you could hear some water in my C sharp key, you want to take a nice deep breath and just force the air out so you don't have that water in your key anymore. All right, I'm going to play it straight through for you. Thanks for watching. Comments, questions, post them below. Bye.